Good evening, everybody. Welcome to Gucci Family Night. This is Mr. Robbie here. How is everyone doing this evening? I hope everyone's having a good time. That's well, I'd be evening. And we're going to get started. Today, we're going to be making our little bobblehead bunny. The tail and everything. <laughs> we can make him bounce. Like a face bounce. All right. Later today, we're also going to be making, doing a, a rubber bouncing egg stem craft project, science project. There you go. This is a, how it looks like after. See how it's all rubbery? This is actually actual egg. So we're going to make a rubber bouncing egg. We got food coloring to it. Add it blue to this one. Pretty cool. You, Stay tuned. All right. So that'll be our later craft. So today, right now, we're going to be making our rabbit here. And we got our craft kits. And you can pick up this craft kit at all three Marina Valley Public Library locations while supplies last. And so we're going to get started here. But first, well, before we get started, we're going to hug our fingers. Hug our fingers here. All right. Okay. Ready to start. All right, I'm gonna set this camera up a little bit so we can get a better picture. All right, I think we got it here. Okay, just keep the cat behind me. All right, sorry I had to come up a little bit, but we're gonna get started. All right, so our scrap kit here, and they all come in different colors, so I pick one at random and. So we have the different ring colors for this craft. <laughs> Hope everyone had a good week. And uh, all right, let's get started. The girl fingers, the girl fingers, everybody. <laughs> all right. So we got our instructions here. Tells you how to do it step by step. Okay. So what we're going to do with this long strip, we're going to fix that first. It's better. Okay. So we're going to get started. So we're going to get this part, long strip here, and we're going to, according to the instructions, get the, we're going to bend it on each side, and uh, we're going to have it like. Do the best you can. It doesn't have to be perfect. And there you go. We gotta bend it like that. Okay. So now we're going to use tape or glue. I'm gonna use tape for most of this project because glue really takes time to, to glue. Not so get sticky. So I'm going to strip. Put a strip of tape, the tape right here. All right. So now we're going to follow the instructions and we're going to see how this works. We're going to put this underneath on the flap like that to make the, the body. There you go. All right, that is pretty cool. So we're going to use Use a little bit more tape and get sticky here. All right, there you go. Now you got the little body here. Match with our little rubber bouncing egg we're going to be doing later. I actually have one started earlier, so I, so I got one in an experiment here. Experiment mode right here. <laughs> but I can write a scientist. <laughs> All right, so now we're going to get one of these little ears. We got the little, we got the little patterns here. I'll actually get all these pieces out. And we got wiggly eyes. I see you. So what we're going to do? We are going to. Move the inner ear, which is this one's coming to that a, a hot pink color. So I'm going to get my glue. So I'm going to use the glue for this part. 
So I'm going to glue right here, like that. And then glue the other one as well. And I'm going to look like flipping and sliding here. All my pieces are on the table. Hi, Amia. How are you doing? Thank you for joining us today. I mean, have a good evening here and watching our virtual family night. <laughs> okay. All right. And hi, Manal, as well. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to get this part and I'm going to glue this into like that. And we're going to get the other ear and we're going to put it my ear right here. I'm just kidding. Maybe right here? No, I'm just kidding too. So we're going to put it right here, like the other one. And I'm going to put these on my head. And I'm going to make myself a bunny rabbit of myself. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Alright, so now we got our ears made here. Oops. Remember, this is still gluing, so it's slipping and sliding. That's uh, so what slipping and the glue and stickiness. Everything's all about here. you go. Oops. <laughs> it's slipping in on, on me here. Okay, we're going to put these aside let them dry up for a little bit. Alright. So, let's see if there's not any more comments. Okay, just making sure. All right. So now we're gonna get the head. This is the little Valentine head. You can tell this is the head one because it has the curve on the top. So we know that you can tell it's the head part. The other ones have the other hearts have like little sharp, just like for the feet. So. Um, so now we're going to glue the ears on the back and we're going to get our glue and we're going to stick them out I'm sticking up behind, I'm sorry see I can get, I can get sticky here <laughs> alright so now we're going to go like that I'm gonna get the other one. I really love this. I really love this craft, and I hope you get to uh, make it. Oops. Oh man, I'm I'm supposed to be gluing it right here. Sorry, on front, and I got a sticky table. <laughs> it's okay. When we, when we do our crafts, there you go. When we do our crafts, we, we get our hands sticky and everything. So so now I'm going to get my wiggly eyes. And we're going to glue the eyes. As you can see, sticking to the table. I've got a lot of glue on the table. How many of you get when you uh, glue or make crafts or do anything on the table and you get it all sticky? My hands are sticky now. So there you go. You've got your one eye. Where's the other eye? Uh, where we go? Oh, here it is. So we got to use the other eye, and I'm going to put it right here. And we're going to glue right there. There you go. Oh, it looks pretty good. Cool. Okay, and I'm going to add the nose. I got a nose. Nobody knows like the nose. Okay. So now we're going to like that. And there is their bunny face. Alright. So now what we're going to do, I'm going to put this down here to let it dry. And uh, so now I'm going to make the medium part. The medium part. And I forgot my scissors. But that's okay. 
No, what we can do when we don't have any scissors, we're going to bend like this. Like that, and then we can work around it and we can make it like that. And we're going to do a little crease. Mine's kind of ripping a little bit, but hey, it works. <laughs> so now I'm going to glue the back of the the back part of the feet right here. And then meet the, right, in the, right here in the corners. And I'm going to add the feet like so. And do the same thing with this one. And so now I got little I got little feet here. So now I'm going to do the same thing with the, the smaller heart. This one's going to go in the front. And I'm going to glue the very bottom right here in the corner. I'll maybe get crazy and go glue it everywhere. So now this part goes right over here. And now we made our little body here so far. So now the tricky part is going to be making making the bobblehead part. So this is a little strip that comes with it. We're going to do a little bending, little small little zigzag. Doesn't have to be perfect, but as long as it works. For this, I'm going to use tape, only because um, the, the glue might not stick too well. So I'm going to use tape. If you have tape at home, that's cool. I think you have a super not super glue. If you have glue that you can know. Uh, I think we will work, but um, since I'm doing a live program, I'm going to do, do this pretty quick. So I'm going to tape the zigzag like that, and I'll put the tape in the corner. Or you can also put glue right over here. I'm going to put it like right over here to the front. Then we had his little wiggly neck. Like a, you know, have you seen those like bobblehead necks? So now I'm going to get the head part. I'm going to use tape again. Thank you for all, thank you for joining everybody. I see some viewers. And uh, hope this is a lot of fun. And stay tuned for the the egg one. I want to show you that one. That's awesome. <laughs> so that's coming up next. So now we've got rabbits and we've got eggs. Hmm. <laughs> but I put two Put them together, right? <laughs> okay. All right. So I'm going to put this tape in the back, connect the head. I'm going to do the best that I can, and hopefully this works. Oops, my nails came off. And and there you go. I make my little. Ooh, my nose keeps coming off. I got a runny nose. Get it? <laughs> or he got the runny nose, or she got the runny nose. Get it? Okay. So there you go. There's my little bubble head. Well, I'm not finished yet. I forgot to add the tail. My tail's still in the bag. And I'm going to put this down here for now. So I'm going to add the tail to make the finale. There you go. I'm going to add the tail. I'll put it in the back. And my nose keeps coming off. But that's okay. All right. And there you go, everybody. And there's your little bobblehead bunny rabbit. And my feet are flipping and flattened too. And there you go. There's your bunny rabbit here. Bobblehead bunny rabbit. <laughs> awesome. All right. I'm going to put the side. I'm going to have them watch my craft. My second steam one. Get my instructions down and get my hands nice and clean. And who's ready to do a steam steam project? All right. So now, like I showed you earlier, this is the the final uh, project. How it came out. So very soft. If you squeeze it really hard, it's gonna crack and then and then yolk will come out. So right now it's like a Boing, boing, boing. Pretty cool. So, how we're going to start? Alright, what you're going to do, you're going to get one of these jars here. And 
It could be a mason jar, it could be a plastic jar, it could be like a, it could be actually be a bowl too. So what you're going to do, I'm going to have a fresh egg here. Get these in the uh, grocery store, get them in the kitchen, in the refrigerator, regular egg. Alright, I want to crack it. So what I'm going to do is also uh, the vinegar. And and also food coloring. So I, like I said earlier, I had another one. So it was already, I have a red one going. So I'm going to do, what color should I choose? Hmm. I got a lot of colors in here. Um, what color should I choose? I'm probably going to pick, I'm going to use green, I'm going to use green food coloring. Alright. Hmm. So what we're going to do, we're going to pour the vinegar into the into the jar. And this jar is plastic by the way, if you have plastic jars, they're safe. So I'm going to be pouring this in here. I don't like to the top. Okay, so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to add the egg into the jar. Be really, really soft. Very slow. Hopefully, it won't crack. Okay, there you go. And there's your egg in the in the jar. So now I'm going to add the food coloring. I'm going to put a little dab. I'm using green this time. All right. So now I'm putting this away. So now we mix and mix. So now the egg is going to get all covered. And the, as you can see, the vinegar starts to um, bubble on the egg. That means it's, it's dissolving the, the shell. So this project actually takes about two to three days. So what I did, so I started this two days ago. So I'm going to do the unveiling on this one. I'm going to get a lot of napkins and let's see how this one comes out. Pull this out and then we're going to put this one in plastic bag so kids won't get knocked over. So right now this is going to be unveiled in two days. Okay, so this is two days later. And we're going to take this one off. Take it out of the... Out of the um, the jar. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to kind of take the excess water out. You can see how it's flying, some of the slime is coming off. So it'll be easier to get the egg out of the jar. Alright, look at that. How cool those are. And also, once they're in the vinegar, these are not to eat. Okay? Um, they're all fun to to touch for sensory as well. But if you squeeze it hard, it's gonna burst just like an egg. So if you want to squeeze it, um, just do it over like a sink or, or your trash can. You want it, you don't want it to get all over the, the place, okay? And also, like I said, under current supervision, these do not eat these, okay? Here, just to look, have fun with. All right, so I'm gonna take this out of the jar. So now, ooh, look at that. So I'm gonna use um, I have water. And I'm going to put some on here so I can rinse it off a little bit. And I got some tap paper towels. Sorry if you can't see it. Here you go. Lots of paper towels. And then the unveiling. Ooh, look at that. And now the egg is, the shell is gone on this one. And all I have is a membrane. The egg and membrane. Look at that. Isn't that cool? You can see the little veins inside. And now I made a rubbery a rubbery egg. So I got two rubbery eggs here now. And that's so cool. Alright, so now we're all set. And this is after two days, so food coloring is a plus if you want to have food colors. And in the meantime I'm gonna set this one for two days. So maybe on Saturday I'm gonna open it up. And we're going to have three colorful 
uh, bouncing rubber eggs. I have no place to bounce it, but but you can squeeze it. You can tell. Look at that. It's pretty cool. Rubbery. All right. I hope you enjoyed this family night, and I hope to see you guys next time. Until then, this is Mr. Robbie saying have a good night and have a good evening, and we'll see you guys next time, okay? Stay safe.